we're back in Rainy's kitchen. Rainy, look at that beautiful tray of spices. I know. Don't we're sneeze. making shrimp tapas. Ooh, shrimp tapas. Oh, yeah, tapas. don't see. Don't yes. see. <laughs> don't see. Stay away um, from it. Weekend tailgating at home, yeah. weekend dinners, last of their three part series. I'm going to make a spice mixture that I save in a jar and oh, use as needed. Look at that. Chili powder, cumin, ground coriander, smoked paprika, garlic powder, the seeds only of dried chili peppers, Those six of them, they are, sugar and salt. So I'm going to put this in here and mix it all up and that's going to be my seasoning mixture for my shrimp. And wow. you don't need all of this mixture. Oh, right? heavens no. Right. I just like to make a lot, so I've got it. Yeah, you got it. Why not? Now, while I'm mixing, I'm going to toss some into the shrimp. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and put the shrimp in some olive oil pans heating. You're going to make the crema with the mayonnaise, sour cream, milk, and the, the lime, grated lime, some cilantro, lime juice, and a little hot sauce. Perfect. Then I'm going to make the slaw. Ooh, okay. Okay. Now these are the big shrimp. You know, these are like the 12 count to oh, a pound. Yeah. Good girl, you're doing a good job there. I'm trying. Now you can see how much I have left over, and you can see that the shrimp are coated. Oh yeah, oh, okay. Right. And here they go. Have fun in there, shrimpies. I'm going to make sure that my shrimp are laying flat, not one on top of another, okay? All I did for the slaw, just so you know, I bought already shredded cabbage. Mm -hmm. I'm adding sweet onion to this. Ooh. Oh, no wonder my eyes aren't burning. No, it's, it's the it's sweet. sweet onion. Mm -hmm. You mind if I take some of your... Go for it. My lime juice that I worked really hard on. Yes. yes. Just going to add some of this to that. And this is always to taste. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add some olive oil. All right, kiddo. I think, ready. Yeah, and I like to do about you know, four or five per. I think four is good, that frankly. Looks like a good one. So I'm going to add some guac, which again, the recipes for this is, they're online. But I had to make things ahead. Sure. Pico de gallo. Oh my gosh, and then for the slaw. slaw. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And because some of these things might be a tad hot, I'm not going to put any hot sauce on. But oh, I, if it were me, I would definitely have hot sauce. Look at that. Thanks, Rania. Oh, you're so welcome. Mm. This is one of my favorite recipes. Mm. Yes, I'm right. I'm right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. See you later. <laughs> I think she likes it. She has all the best <laughs> assignments today. For a copy of today's recipe, go to PittsburghTodayLive.com. We have it posted for you there.